You know, this film really did have a super interesting premise. And maybe my expectation was a little bit high because something just didn't click for me. And I'm not quite sure what it is, but maybe we'll figure it out in this review. So I don't know. Let's just, let's just start and get into this right now. <laughs> What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel today for another review and today we're going to be reviewing the film Deep which is going to be releasing on Netflix July 16th. Now yeah this the premise of this is super interesting and I guess my expectations was just a little bit too high because when it all was said and done I was just like okay I didn't hate it but I didn't love it but it also super lacked something because I also feel like it could have been a lot better in some department i'm not really sure what it is i think i know what it is but we'll, 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 we'll discuss it in a second but so that you know what the premise of this film is and by the way i need to stop watching films about sleeping issues and whatnot because uh the last few i watched definitely didn't like them and you know not that i didn't like this one but like i don't know it's not it's not it's not a good track record right now but uh so you have these four medical students who obviously have that in common but beyond that the four of them all have other forms of hobbies or just personal things going on in their life they also have something else in in, in common and that they all are suffering from all forms of sleep issues insomnia and all that other good stuff um so one way or another they all are trying to look for solutions some are medically referred some are referred by friends and they all um are are basically lured into participating into a secret neuroscientific experiment called deep so here's the thing what's the catch with this because anytime something's secret it's never a good thing well one because they're medical students they're broke i mean sure they make some money on the side but like they can obviously use some other money extra money for other reasons the the, the catch here is that in order to successfully participate in this program, they have to stay awake without falling asleep, uh, depending on what tier they pick. The higher the tier, the more the money, but the longer you have to stay awake. And if you fall asleep for longer than 60 seconds, then you die. So here's the first thing to me. This definitely sounds like a horror film, and it's not. And then it sounds like it's a thriller, and I also don't, I never felt the urge of suspense at all like i feel like there was a huge disconnect with the characters here and you know i don't think it has nothing to do about the nationality of the film or the styling of the film because i think universally this should work because this is natively a thai film it's spoken in the native language of thai it is dubbed for netflix um the dubbing is super questionable uh and the reason why it's questionable is because i feel like the, the pitches of certain voices don't really add to the drama of the of certain scenes um and th you know that's why i probably do need to watch it back in thai and kind of see how my emotions kind of play with that but i did watch it originally in the english dub but i did i never really felt the suspense and the drama or even the dread from e any of our protagonists here because they all got sort of interesting backstories. One is a gamer, so he streams and not how he makes his money. One is a social media influencer. And, you know, obviously the more time they're able to devote to this is the more money they can generate uh, revenue for, for either one of them. And then you have somebody else who's also, you know, studying for, for, for medical school, but also needs the extra money so she can take care of her family. And, you know, now having to take care of the family, work and medical school, this actually is a convenience for her because it's it, fo it's, it fixes two things, but it's always a catch-22 with everything. It's a gamble. It's high stakes. Um, so, you know, at the end of the day, it's, it's sort of the idea of like, okay, cool. We all want them to fix their sleeping issues. We all want them to generate more money for whatever their adventures that they have. There's obviously some, there's always love interest involved. There's some love stuff going on inside of this. But the big thing is, is like, the person that's behind this who is this person can we trust them 
what's their what's their real you know what what's their real objective behind putting out this experiment this this uh scientific neuroscientific experiment like what's what's really your driving factor here and so while that's an aspect of the film it also felt unfulfilling when we kind of found out like oh that's why okay cool <laughs> so it's like i don't know i feel like the, the the connectional factor to our characters lacked the premise again i still think is really good like i'll be 100 percent honest if they took this premise and redid it and just tweaked a few things this could probably be a really fantastic film because i again i think it's super interesting considering um you know the nature of the sleep issues and the idea of them happen to fall asleep and the hallucination behind it um the fact that this is not no tucked away issue like other people have went through this like it has a little bit of a of an exposure to society as to like something's going on like it, it's it's sort it's really interesting but it again it just lacked something so ultimately i didn't hate this film i think this is a film that is streamable um it i don't think it's a tough watch it's about an hour and a half um, but it just was lacking something and I and I think that something was really the, the, just the connection to these characters like if they're suffering from sleep and they're suffering from finances then they take this this gamble in order to do this um, this uh, this neuroscientific experiment that you know is top secret and it's like oh, okay there's a risk to this and there's also a huge risk of a fatal risk at, involved with this it's just like that's enough of a compelling story to say like i really should care about these people and i really never did <laughs> and i don't think the social media influencer character helped at all too because how over the top that character is you never ever for one bit thought that she was ever going to have an issue at all but like the gamer who's like a complete introvert you're like okay i can see him not like being comfortable in this situation and then the one uh, lady who is you know trying to do this for a family so cool you backing behind her and then you got the other guy who is in love with her and it's just like but why why is this necessary etc cetera, etc cetera. i don't know i don't know but yeah again this is deep this will be on netflix if you're checking it out jump in the comments and let me know and as always folks stay tuned for more reviews I'm <laughs> sorry.